right, so this is the end of week eight. Technically, this is week two of uh, digestive. Last week was a little odd because of everything that happened at MSU, um, and it was basically like learning from home, but at the same time, the week didn't really count, so we're gonna redo a week in May. Um, but this week was kind of hectic in that we were just trying to figure out what the heck we were supposed to be doing with all the changes that happened and curriculum parts being moved around, labs being on different days. It was just like every day I was just trying to figure out where I was supposed to be, what I was supposed to be doing, what I was supposed to be studying at home. Um, I've also been feeling really unmotivated lately and I don't know if last week had anything to do with that or if I'm just ready for spring break, but um, Jenna's mom was also in town this week so um, I was trying to kind of do the do the minimum and then be able to spend time with Jenna and her and not just be holed up in my room studying but um, yeah overall it wasn't too bad of a week we didn't have a test today it's gonna be next week over uh, this week and the following so basically two weeks on one test and uh, yeah next week is the last week before spring break so I'm going to try to grind out some good work this weekend and try to catch up on things I didn't get done during the week and get back to where I should be. And um, yeah, hopefully next week is a, is a strong finish to the first two weeks of digestive and then I can kind of put that on the back burner until uh, May when we have to do the last week. Um, and uh, I was trying to think if there's anything else. Oh, my side class is the longitudinal stuff we have to do. I've got, I'm like kind of a little bit ahead of schedule on that, so I have a little bit of stuff got to do this weekend. But I think by and large I've done everything that I need to, which is a good feeling because I can kind of just not think about that too much. So that is, that is a wrap on another week. And uh, yeah, hopefully next week goes well.